Thanks, Matt. I don't know, I, I kind of like the beard stubble. All right, switching it up now. Drumsticks, bling, and lots of leather. It's all rock and roll, and it's all on the road right now. Jake Peterson introduces us to a guy who decides what iconic items travel the country for music fans to see up close and what does not make the playlist. Threads from legends like Whitney Houston and Michael Jackson are spending the summer on the road touring the country with the Treasures of the Hard Rock Tour. It was worn by Michael in 88. Jeff Nolan is an expert on this multi-million dollar collection, but soon he and some of these gems will be back home at the company's Rock Vault in Orlando, Florida. This is the spot. Check it out. We're not worthy! Some of the rock's most iconic pieces are stored inside a nondescript warehouse. And though it's not open to the public, we managed to get an inside look at the hub of this collection. That's awesome! We're over 77,000 pieces and growing. And Jeff has an amazing talent of memorizing each item's history. I am definitely a music geek. He makes sure everything is in great shape when it's seen by the public. I would say we probably have about 20,000 guitars in the collection, give or take. Squeeze me? Most iconic items in the collection? Michael Jackson's jacket from the Beat It video, a Jimi Hendrix guitar, and the handwritten lyrics to John Lennon's Imagine. Any music lover would be like a kid in a candy store here. It's kind of like Willy Wonka for music fans. Your imagination. Wonder who this belongs to. Only Elton John gets away with this. The Hard Rock has memorable items, but then there are those pieces that are just cool. Hey look, this is Madonna's yearbook. Nearly anything that's associated with a famous musical artist has a home here, no matter the genre. The collection keeps growing, so if you haven't seen it, Jeff and the Hard Rock will be displaying more musical memories in the future. For The List, I'm Jake Peterson.